Uh, today we will see this problem. Uh, we need to prove that tan theta plus secant theta minus 1 divided by tan theta minus secant theta plus 1 equal to 1 plus sin theta by cos theta. So, just by looking at this problem, first uh, thought is we need to expand tan theta by sin theta by cos theta and secant theta by 1 by cos theta. If we expand in that way, I will tell you the thing. Let us take RHS. What is RHS? 1 plus sin theta by cos theta. Again, if we expand this one, 1 by cos theta plus tan theta. So, this can be written as secant theta plus tan theta. Right. Okay. See, the RHS is secant theta plus tan theta. But we know that secant square theta minus tan square theta equal to 1. So, by looking at this one, we are able to know that we need to expand 1 with secant square theta minus tan square theta. That means, to solve these type of problems, instead of just to jump into the problem and do the problem, we need to do some uh, thought process in the mind. If we do that one, it will be easy. Suppose if you have two, three ways, right? We need to select the best possible way. That is the thing we need to do, okay? Now, we know that secant square theta minus tan square theta equal to 1. Secant square theta minus tan square theta equal to 1. Just to substitute this value, secant square theta minus tan square theta in place of 1. Okay. This is tan theta plus secant theta minus secant square theta minus tan square theta whole divide by tan theta minus secant theta plus 1. Secant square theta minus tan square theta, this is in which form? This is in the form of a square minus b square. a square minus b square can be expanded as a plus b into a minus b. In the same way, secant square theta minus tan square theta equal to secant theta plus tan theta into secant theta minus tan theta. Just we need to substitute whatever the value we have got here. here. So, if I substitute in that way, tan theta plus secant theta minus, okay, secant theta plus tan theta into secant theta minus tan theta whole divided by tan theta minus secant theta plus 1. Okay. Now, see, in this term and in this term, tan theta plus secant theta is the common term in these two. So, if we take this common, we can further simplify this equation to a tan theta plus secant theta common. Okay. Tan theta plus secant theta. Here what is the remaining one, right? 1 minus, we took tan theta plus secant theta common. So, this is minus of minus secant theta plus tan theta whole divided by tan theta minus secant theta plus 1. So, in the numerator and the, in the denominator both are common. So, in, so we can, uh, if we divide same term in the numerator and the denominator, these two get cancelled. So, the final thing is what tan theta plus secant theta, right. 
tan theta how we can write tan theta is sin theta by cos theta plus what is secant theta 1 by cos theta in these two terms cos theta is common so the lcm of cos theta and cos theta is cos theta in the numerator sin theta plus 1 which is rhs in this way we able to prove that tan theta plus secant theta minus 1 divided by tan theta minus secant theta plus 1 equal to 1 plus sin theta by cos theta okay again i will explain here what we have to do is we need to expand this one with sin square theta minus tan square theta here two ways are possible one is just to expand sin tan theta with sin theta by cos theta plus secant theta with 1 by cos theta but if we consider the rhs in the rhs rhs side we should have secant theta plus tan theta that is why i substitute secant square theta minus tan square theta okay in the place of 1 if we do this one okay tan theta plus secant theta tan theta plus secant theta in the place of 1 secant square theta minus tan square theta if we write this way the value of the value doesn't change right so that's why i substitute 1 with secant square theta minus tan square theta right just to expand secant square theta minus tan square theta secant square theta minus tan square theta in the form of what a square minus b square we know that a square minus b square equal to a plus b into a minus b so in the in the same terms secant square theta minus tan square theta can be written as secant theta plus tan theta into secant theta minus tan theta right after expansion we can what we can do we can take secant theta plus tan theta is common in this term as well as in the second term so we can take this common if we take this secant theta plus tan theta term which is common in both first term and second term we can write this as right tan theta plus secant theta into right one right this is one minus secant theta secant theta minus of minus plus tan theta tan theta and uh, denominator is tan theta minus secant theta plus one in the numerator and denominator one minus secant theta plus tan theta both are same right then I strike out same term in both the numerator and denominator. If we, if I do the same, the value of this uh, term doesn't change, right? Uh, after that, what uh, I got tan theta plus secant theta. I took tan theta plus secant theta. Tan theta can be written as sin theta plus cos theta. Plus secant theta can be written as 1 by cos theta. In these both terms, what is the denominator cos theta? So cos theta. And in the numerator, just we can add values in the numerator. So sin theta plus cos theta, which is RHS. In this way, we are able to prove. Right? Do you have any questions? Okay. If you don't have any questions, just to note it down. Okay. Okay. These type of uh, Mm, questions normally ask in the four mark uh, questions okay four mark questions these are all. and another way to check whether okay another way to check whether tan theta plus secant theta minus 1 by tan theta minus secant theta plus 1 equal to 1 plus sin theta by cos theta are, both are equal or not just to consider theta equal to some 45 okay for the given 45 evaluate uh, left hand side and uh, evaluate right hand side both should be equal right that is just to uh, be able to check whether uh, lhs equal to rhs or not okay yeah.